The Blender plugin is installed in Quixel Bridge, but if I try to import an asset into Blender 4, even if it's said exported successfully, nothing happened in Blender. As we can see, I have now my mesh. We need to first install manually the script for Blender. So let's quit Blender and go to the Megascan uh, library under support. Plugin Blender, we got this uh, the script here. So let's uh, use the 3.7 here. We got this MS plugin, let's uh, select it and copy. Now we need to go to the uh, user username, find the app data, which is an hidden uh, folder. You will need to unhide the hidden uh, element. So under app data roaming, Blender Foundation, Blender, we need to install it here. In my case is the 4.2. And under script here, we need to create a new folder. So let's add a new folder and rename it in lowercase start up. And this is in this folder, we need to pass this MS plugin, which is just a script. Simply by doing this, if I go back to Blender 4.2.1, and try to import the same asset. Of course, I already set up my export target to Blender. Now I click, export it successfully, and now I have the mesh. But there is no uh, shader or texture. As we can see, the shader looks like this. If we open up the toggle system console uh, window, as we can see, Megascan plugin error rail imported texture, blah, 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 blah. The key specular is not found. So this name is, it should be the name of the input, which not exist uh, in this version of the principal BSDF. So we need to edit the script uh, to replace this uh, wrong name. And this is actually easy. So let's open up the script into uh, the, the text uh, editor in Blender. So I will uh, go here to copy um, the path and click on open in Blender and open the init.py file. So this is the script um, Blender need to communicate with uh, the Quixel app. So if we click in here, we got this find and replace uh, tool. So what we need to find is where specular is. So let's click on case to make sure it um, respect this big S here. Click find next. And we need to click here until we get this first one here inside uh, this two code. This is a string. This is a name we need to replace. And we need to replace it with the correct socket name. So to get the correct socket name, let's back to the shader editor to get a principal BSDF and find the specular uh, flag here. This is this socket we need to use to plug a texture. So let's right click and click on copy full data path. Now back to the scripting uh, workspace and under the console here, we need to simply pass uh, the data path. We don't need the point default value at the end. So let's delete it and type in name, enter. And this gave us the correct socket name we need to use. So let's select it, right click, copy, and simply replace in the script. So let's do it everywhere we need to do it. So let's pass, find next. Okay, for specular. As we can see, we also have transmission here and clear cut here. Transmission should be problematic. So again, right click, copy full data path, just pass it into the console delete 
default value and type in name enter and this is not transmission but transmission weight so let's copy this right click and replace where it should be replaced so uh, to make sure i not forgot one let's type in transmission find next okay yes done so same for the clear cut clear cut clear cut okay back uh, to the beginning of the text and click find next uh, we have only one to change so again back to the shader editor this is here cut i guess this is a weight right click copy full data path and again past delete the end and type in name enter and this is named coat weight so right click copy and simply paste it all we have to do now is simply uh, save the text so text save it should replace uh, the one here say 10 49 yeah correct time so correctly saved we need to quit blender and relaunch it this is because it is in a startup uh, folder and the script is automatically loaded when um, blender is opened so let's reopen blender 4.2.1 delete everything and try to import the same asset so let's click here export it successfully got the mesh if i go to the shadow view it correctly imported with the uh, shader and all the texture perfect so let's try with another one let's say uh, this parking matter here as we can see the export button is gray i don't know why but uh, there is one here we can use it will do the same and this is the object with the correct shader perfect as we can see specular is now a plugin into IRL level socket let's try with um, an asset uh, which uses the transmission let's say this one again no export button available but we can click here nothing happened in blender because this is not a mesh not an object but simply a material as we can see is here so let's try to apply it into a single plane and it works properly as as we can see the transmission is correctly plugged perfect so if you have any other issues go to windows uh, toggle the system console and see uh, if there is any error reported by the quicksell um, plugin and change the name and yellow yellow i hope uh, you find this useful and thanks for watching bye